Hey, Just Bricks here with another video for you. Um, I'm going to be doing a haul today. Um, got a few packages, and I'm pretty excited about these. So here are my packages. I'm very excited about these. Um, first off, I got my prize pack from the Great Brick Lab. Um, this is my second prize pack from them. Um, I know there's a couple pieces in there that they said said we're going to be in there that are I'm, I'm looking forward to. Um, this package here is from Doug um, over at, I believe, I, I think you pronounce it Dotu Bricks, D-O-T-U Bricks. Um, he just started his YouTube channel, so I think this box is actually one of his videos the other day. But what's inside of it is something that he helped me um, get a hold of, and I'm excited about that. And then that's probably the biggest thing for my haul today is something big for my store. Um, the biggest single purchase in my store history, I think. Uh, and it's my brand new laptop, which I'm looking forward to showing off a little bit here so in a bit. Opening this in the same way that Doug showed in one of his videos the other day, where you slice the ends first, and then you kind of lift it up and slice along the top seam. That way you're not gonna damage anything inside. Um, it's very difficult to do with one hand, but he learned that from working around books and stuff. I think, it's, I think that's what he said. I learned it from opening ceiling fans as an electrician. You can't cut too, too tight to the seam or you'll damage the blades of the fan. And let's see what we got here. Oh, I dropped it. Can you guess what it is? Can you tell what it is? It's the buildable teal brick. This set was a promotion just about a little over a week ago. Um, set 6346101. But yeah, it's a VIP promotion that you can only get if you spent I believe it was $200, um, which was a little outside of my budget as I was trying to save up for that box. And so I asked a couple people if they had gotten any, and Doug had one, and I was able to get that from him. And I'm going to be building this and displaying it in my shop because the dark turquoise color there, that's kind of my store color. So really looking forward to getting that built. And then let's go ahead and open this one. See if I can do this one-handed. All right, so let's see what we got here. What's that say? Minifig Accessories Brick Forge. So they said that this was going to be a pack of Brick Forge um, military parts. These are custom parts. Got the military helmet and custom printed torso there with the um, grenades and uh, combat vest and all that. That's some cool printing on there. Let's see, we got a thumper. Grenade launcher, it looks like. Got some, it looks like an Air Force cap. That's pretty cool. Some helmets. And these are the Star Wars figures that I said were going to be in there. Because I found... Wait, actually, they sent me this one in the first pack. I found, I think, two other ones in a bulk lot. And so I'm kind of getting a little collection of these things. Let's see what else we got here. We got a machine gun. Oh, man, that's a cool machine gun right there. Uh, we got a stick grenade. And... It looks like a 1911. I could be wrong. I'm not super good on guns. I believe that's supposed to be... What's that? An M1 Garand? Sweet. That is nice looking. These are some cool little accessories here. Cool. I actually have a little bit of a collection of these. Just a few from an order. Probably back before... It was the last time my store was open. Let me go ahead and grab that and... The these are brick forge. I think they are. 
but it's been a long time since I ordered these, so and we got these helmets there. I believe this was supposed to be like a German style helm. A weird translucent RPG and some other guns and things there. And so I just have this little collection of non-Lego but Lego compatible accessories that I think are pretty cool. So I'll add those pieces in with that. And thanks again to the uh, the Great Brick Lab guys. Let's see if we can get their card out of there so you can see all their stuff. Yep, the Great Brick Lab. And there's all their information. Some really good guys over there. And there we go. And Brick Forge freebies. And thanks again for that, guys. And let's get this put away, and I'll open the cut the tape to make sure that I can get this open. And I still can't get it. <laughs> oh, come on. Let's try this. Oh, yeah. Got the seals cut there. So, I'm not super tech savvy so I had a friend of mine who uh, does a lot of live streams and all for our church he gave me some pointers on what to look for in my laptop and so I got a brand new Dell they were having a Black Friday sale where it was $200 off the regular price So I got this Dell Inspiron. It has the 15.6 uh, inch display. It's wireless and Bluetooth. Has a i5 processor. A let's see, eight gigabytes of RAM and a one terabyte hard drive. I'm looking forward to seeing how this works. Yeah, I kind of figured I'd need to charge it. So, I am, oh, it looks like it's coming on. There it is, first boot up. And I'm really looking forward to using this for my store. I got one that should be capable of streaming, so I'm hoping to do some live streams for my channel. Also, um, this will make it so I can use brick stock, and I'm looking forward to doing that. And I also plan on getting a better, um, editing software for my videos as so far everything I've been doing I've been shooting and editing on my phone and there's just a couple things uh, I have a video that I started uh, last week on parting out the uh, creator sets the set 11717 I believe and I was having I was trying to do two different camera angles and the editing was just a little too much for my phone where it wasn't wasn't great trying to get it done so um, I think that'll be simpler on a laptop and so looking forward to trying this stuff out and hopefully it's an improvement to both my store and the channel um, so I'm gonna go ahead and see if I can get this thing set up and thanks for watching see what happens okay it's it's taking forever so anyway thanks for watching um until next time y'all have a good one